The outer solar system, realm of the giant gas planets, is the true home of the superstorm. The planet Jupiter is so vast that more than a thousand Earths could fit easily inside, a planet that's all atmosphere. As long ago as the 17th century, the astronomer Cassini saw a mysterious dark shape moving on Jupiter's surface. The great red spot turned out to be a type of hurricane, twice the size of the Earth. Now, after more than 300 years, the great red spot is still raging, and it's not alone. The surface of Jupiter is teeming with storms. Weather on Earth is powered by the sun's heat, but Jupiter only gets a fraction of this energy because it is five times further from the sun than we are. Jupiter's weather is driven by a powerful engine deep in its secret interior. The greatest flashes of lightning ever seen were detected on Jupiter by the Galileo spacecraft. Thunderbolts 50 miles across and 100 times brighter than typical lightning flashes on Earth. Only Jupiter's outer surface is visible, but its lightning gave us a window into the planet's hidden interior. And when 700 miles of cloud broke its surface, planetary scientists were seeing the same thunderstorms as those on Earth, but on a terrifying scale. And this was extremely exciting because now we had lightning on another planet and we've actually correlated the lightning with certain types of clouds that you see on Jupiter. In, in particular, these beautiful bright white plumes that come out of nowhere and just erupt in the low pressure regions on Jupiter. Jupiter gives out twice as much energy as it receives from the sun with heat left over from the planet's formation. As it cools, hot gases rise towards the surface, powering thunderstorms as they go.